Hello and welcome to another Chevionet tutorial. Okay, what we're going to be doing today is I'm going to show you how to add your business to the Chevionet website with your free listing and also how to edit and maintain that inform information including your chosen picture. Okay, so I'm just going to go to my browser go to the Chevio website. Now this tutorial does assume you have already registered with us and activated your account. If you haven't, you will need to do that before you can um, add your free listing to the Chevionet website. If you don't know how to do that, just come up here, click on the register link, click create a free account, complete this form and there is a tutorial to cover that. And you'll notice up here that it says click here to get to our video tutorial. Okay, so let's get started. We're going to quickly log in. Click login. I'm going to just enter your registered um, email address and password. I'm going to use the one, the sample one I'm using for this tutorial, and click login. Now this is a very, very, very simple process. It doesn't take any IT knowledge whatsoever. Now you're in the my account area of the website now, and you'll see the menu down on the left hand side. Now I'm going to click on my business listings and this is a sample one that I've created earlier but what we're going to do today is click add a new business listing so I'm going to add a business listing for uh, Chevionet you don't require any address information that's absolutely fine obviously it's ideal for your customers to be able to find you if you can for if you provide your e your full address anyway I'm going to put an email address in here. Now your web address and email address and your, your mobile number are all optional but you will be required to provide at least your telephone number. Okay, I'm just going to put it in here. We are community website and you get up to I think it's about 250 characters in there. I'm going to click on here and I'm going to add this to just a random one. I think we'll just put artist and galleries because I don't think we have anything under that. Now, if you want to add a picture, I'm going to show you how to do that. Now, you don't have to. This you can add your company logo or just whatever chosen picture you have for your business. So I'm going to click on browse. Now, I don't actually have any pictures on here. So what I'm going to do is just borrow one of these sample pictures here. That one will do. Now our free so our online software will edit and change the picture size apps for you so you don't have to do any cropping or changing before that. Now you get the option here to place a free ad, a premium ad and a priority ad. The free ad will just go anywhere within the listings of the, the, your chosen category. A premium ad will be higher up in the results and your top priority ad will go at the very very top of the listings with the other top priority ads for your chosen category. We ask um, for people to choose the premium or priority ad because it does help fund Shebionet and keep us online. For now, for simplicity, I'm going to choose the free ad. Now all you need to do is click Add Business. The process happening now is editing your picture and changing it, cropping it to the right sizes. So the time, depending on your internet connection speed, this it can take between one or five minutes depending on the size of the picture that we're having to alter for you. Okay, so now that shows that it's dealing with it. There we go, listing created. Now what I'm going to do is show you how to get back to this screen here. So I'm going to go back to the My Account area, which is the area you see when you first log in. And I'm going to come down to here to My Business Listings. Now this is the one I've just created. And I'm just going to view that. Or what we can do is come over here to edit. And you can make as many changes to these to this information here as you like. You can update your address, website, telephone numbers, your uh, the about your business section, and if you find a more appropriate category, you can make a change to it there. And you can also edit your two optional categories because we always find that you know each category doesn't suit every business. So there may you may come under more 
um, than just one section that you want to appear in. Like here, if you do want to edit your pictures, it shows what you've got uploaded. You just again click here and it will delete that picture and upload your new one. Now, if you've made changes, just simply click edit my business record and you're done. Now, I'm just going to double check that this does appear as I want it to. So, I'm going to have a look at the artist and gallery section on the website where all um, members and just general people visiting the website will see it. So, I've got artist and galleries. And there's my business listing. And that's it. And it will show the listing is verified by owner because you've added the listing. And if you are logged in and you're looking at your own listing, you can select edit straight from the business directory itself. And that will take you back to it. Obviously, we don't have to make any changes at the moment. Now, if you need any help with anything else, you can visit our YouTube channel. The link is, as always, down the bottom at the bottom of our page. And you will also find our video tutorials on the website by clicking on the video tutorials link at the bottom of the page. That's it for now and thanks for watching.